fly like a bird. We keep the commandments on those you heard. Pull out some scripts like I'm a director. I stay with my sword, I'm ready whenever. It's the end of the world. We have to believe in Jesus Christ as the scripture has said. How you doing, sir? You can scoot up a little bit more. Just, just a tad. Let me ask you a question real quick. You don't want to be on camera? Okay, I'll praise. Uh, you believe in the Bible, sir? You do? Yes. Okay, read that again, that scripture. The book of John, chapter 7 and verse 38. Uh -huh. He that believeth on me, as the scripture has said, uh -huh. out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. So, what's your name, sir? Joe Julio. You said who? Okay, okay, I'll pray. You said the table. All right, Mr. Julio, the scripture said we must believe in on Jesus as the scripture has said, right? So let me ask y'all a question real quick. Y'all grew up in church? Okay, I'll praise it. Check it out. Who is this right here, sir? Jesus. That's Jesus Christ. Where did we learn this from? Did we learn this out of the Bible or were we told this by a man? Or do y'all think this is biblical? You said got this from the Bible? So, I'm going to read to you real quick before y'all leave. I'm gonna to read to y'all what Jesus Christ looked like. And let me know, after I read it, let me know if this is Jesus Christ. Just work with me real quick, Julio. Revelation chapter one, verse one. The book of Revelation chapter one and verse one. Bring it out. We just read the scripture said, he that believeth on Jesus as the scripture hath said. Not as my pastor told me what Jesus Christ looked like. We got to believe on Christ as the scripture has said, right? All praise. Y'all agree with me right now? Yes, sir. Revelation 1 and 1. Check it out. The revelation of Jesus Christ. Uh -huh. Oh, my fault. Yeah. The revelation of what? Jesus Christ. So, right now, this is the revelation of Jesus Christ. Meaning what? We are about to reveal what Jesus Christ looked like to y'all. Because this is very important. We must know how the Messiah looked when he walked right. the earth. Because right now... It's who they gave us is Jesus Christ. But let's see if that's biblical or not. Read that. Verse 14, his head and his hair were white like wool. You heard that? It said Jesus Christ. The first description John the Revelator said, his head and his hairs were white like wool. Read that from the top one more time. The book of Revelation chapter one and verse 14, his head and his hairs were white like wool. So who has woolly hair it said christ's hair was white in color and woolly in texture right so what race of people today has woolly hair who we all have woolly hair woolly hair right now is it, it would be considered like nappy hair that's wool of the sun where is it other side other side no, no, it ain't right here. It ain't right here. Right we here. got it. It's right there in front of you. Oh, All right, so look. This right here. Woolly hair. Sheep has hair like wool, correct? So what I'm asking y'all, what race of people has that woolly texture hair? You said who, sir? You said black people? This Good. right here is woolly texture hair. Right? Now look. Does this man have woolly textured hair? This is straight hair, correct? Look at this sign right here. This sign right here. That's woolly hair. Would you agree? All praise. Look, that's the first description of Jesus Christ. Hold on, one second. One second, sir. I'm gonna show him. You gonna show him the picture? Okay, cool, cool. So the first one was his hair was white like wool, right? Now check this out. His head and his hair were white like wool, uh -huh. as white as snow, uh -huh. and his eyes were as they flame of fire. So, this is the second description. So, this dude already got one strike. His hair is not white and wooly. That's correct? But look over here. That's white and wooly hair. And then and the second one said his eyes were as a flame of fire. When you look at different pictures of Jesus Christ, the one that they give us, he has blue eyes. Blonde, stringy hair, and blue eyes. But it said Christ's eyes was what? As a flame of fire. Read that a little bit louder for me. His head and his hair were white like wool, as white as snow, and his eyes were as a flame of fire. So, now Jesus Christ's eyes were as a flame of fire, meaning the whites of his eyes were red. Do y'all know why that was? What was his first, you said who? You 
said why? Oh, he said why? What was Jesus Christ's first miracle? He turned, he turned water into wine at a wedding. And Jesus Christ drank wine in moderation. And when you drink, the whites of your eyes turn red. So Jesus Christ had white woolly hair and his eyes was red. Correct? Now, it's going to get even better for y'all. Keep reading. Verse 15. And his feet like unto... And his feet. Now, John the Revelator is going to Jesus Christ's feet. Now we're talking about the color of his skin. Read. Like unto fine brass. So, his feet was like unto fine brass. What color is brass? You say who? <laughs> Gold. Brass is a derivative of brown. Y'all agree with that? Like a penny. Copper. That's a derivative of brown. So he said, Jesus Christ's feet was like unto fine brass. Now check this out. As if they burned in a furnace. Y'all heard that? Read that again. Bring it out. As if they burned in a furnace. So his feet was like fine brass. Jeez. As if they burned in a furnace. Right? So if you burn anything, what color does it turn? You said who? Brown? No. Brass. Brass is brown. If you was baking some cookies and you burned them, what color do those cookies? They turn what color? Turn black. Bro, read that again. His feet. His feet and his and his feet like a fine brass, as if they burn in a furnace. So Jesus Christ's feet were like fine brass, as if they burn in a furnace. Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. I want you to know that you can view all our Sabbath classes live on IUIC TV. That's right, I said on IUIC TV. Download the app today. Shalom. So, if Christ's feet looked like he was burned up, what color was Christ's feet? Black, then what color was his legs? What color was his arms? What color is Jesus Christ? He's a black man yes, according to the Bible. Right, right. So who is this? Jesus. This is Jesus? So did you just did you just hear the scripture I read? And you agree that it had he had woolly hair, his skin was fine brass burned in a furnace, which is black. Then if Jesus Christ is describing a black man, how is this Jesus, Mr. Julio? You know. It's not Jesus. So who is this man right here? You don't know. That's right. This is a real man named Caesar Borgia. If you look him up online, this man will pop up. That's a real man, Caesar Borgia. They gave us this man right here to make us think this was Jesus Christ. But in the Bible, what color is Jesus Christ? Your Lord and Savior Jesus Christ is a black man. Right. So let me ask y'all this. If they change Jesus Christ's image, do y'all think they change his message also? Because what do they teach? They teach this man, Jesus Christ, is coming back to save who? Who is Jesus Christ coming back to save? You said who? All humanity. That's what they teach us. But y'all got to understand, they gave us another image. And what came with that image? Another gospel, right. another doctrine, right. another message. So. Let's see who Jesus Christ is coming to save, because this is very important. Y'all just learned something that Jesus Christ is a black man. All praise to the Most High. When y'all praying, don't ever have this image in y'all head, praying to a white Jesus. He does not exist. There's no white Jesus. He's a black man according to the Bible. Check this out real quick. The book of Matthew chapter 15 and verse 24. Bring it out! But he answered and said, I am not sent but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. This is Jesus Christ right now. He said, but he answered and said, I am not sent, but unto the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Meaning what? Jesus Christ is not coming back to save everybody. He was only sent to the Israelites. That's right. And the good thing about this, y'all will be Israelites. That's right. You're not Hispanic. You're not Latino. I'm not black, African American. I am an Israelite. Y'all are Israelites. That's so what right. Does that mean? Jesus Christ will be coming back for us. Right. If we keep in the commandments of God. That's what this is all about. 
nationality, repentance, and keeping the commandments of God. Right. So before y'all pull out, what color is Jesus Christ, sir? is you. 